All right, I'm inside the turkey coop now. I have my wires for my panels coming in. First thing I'm going to do is install two 10 amp breakers. So it gives the ability to shut off the power coming from the panels as I'm putting the box together. So that'll be my first thing is put in some breakers. It's pretty dusty in here, so we'll see. And I know it's dark, you can't really see too good, but that's why we're putting in the light. All right, it's a little dark but those are the breakers on the rails. So I'm just gonna run the wires, come through the wall there, right into my breakers. All right, so you can see the breaker coming in, had that dust mask on there. So this is the power coming in from the panels. I got my voltmeter. So you see I got 23 volts coming in even though it's a 12 volt panel and that's why you need the charge controller to control the electrical getting to the battery and down here got nothing so to turn on the breakers Twenty-three volts, so it protects my charge controller, it protects my system from surges, but also makes it real easy just to cut the power coming into the room. All right, just because the cramp, dusty conditions, it wasn't really possible to film a lot of this as I was going through, but we'll still show you what we've got here so far. So let me spin the camera around. You can see the power coming in. Got a set of breakers there. Did a little cable management comes down here comes in the back of the box I've got my little 10 amp charge controller there got the, the battery the deep cycle battery showing 97% it's my little battery meter and then I've got my inverter so everything's plugged up inside the box that I can then close up so I'm gonna keep going and wiring the, the coop, but I just want to show you this. As I said, it just wasn't practical in the dark and the cramped conditions to film it out. But if you want to see where we're at, that, that's what we got set up so far. So that is my light fixture right here inside the chicken coop. It wasn't really practical to film a whole lot, but I'll walk you through what I did. We'll start backwards. So you see a light fixture, there's two LED light bulbs in there. It comes down here to a dimmer switch. Since I don't have enough power to run it all the way, I can dim it out if I want. Put in an outlet down here just in case I need to plug something in. Wire runs around the back here into the back of my box. So in the box we have the 1000 watt inverter which is overkill. I'll admit that it's just what I have. We have the 12 volt 100 amp hour deep cycle lead acid battery. A little battery meter going there and then I have my solar charge controller and those cords are going out the back you see they're coming up here up the wall to my little 10 amp breakers that go outside to the panel so that's it one panel one hundred amp hour lead acid battery one inverter one charge controller basically gets you one light bulb for 24 hours so that's kind of how it works out so it didn't really get to show a lot just not not practical so showing off got my light hanging out there in the background and the turkeys the baby turkeys we're going to bring out here which is kind of what we're doing got a turkey coming over to check me out here yep you got light there buddy he just realized he's got light it's a hot box in here, but the baby turkeys will be happy. We're gonna move the baby turkeys out and didn't want to put them in a dark room So hope that helps out. I said I know I didn't film a whole lot of the process But if you have any questions, let me know as always. Thanks for watching and we appreciate you